Hi, I'm Tiffany LeMay, and this is I Ate the Divorce Papers Charles from Goodbye Charles by Gabriel Davis for my Theater One monologue final. Um, thank you, Professor Broomer. You have been amazing, and I've really loved your class. And I hope all of your classes are wonderful next year. Thank you. I ate them. Yeah, that's right. I ate the divorce papers, Charles. I ate them with ketchup. <laughs> they were good. Good. <laughs> you probably want me to get serious about this divorce. <sighs> but the thing is, you always caught our marriage a joke. So let's use logic here, okay? A, if we never had a serious marriage, then B, we can't have a serious divorce. No, we can't. The whole thing's a farce, Charles. <laughs> a farce that tastes good with ketchup. I mean, wasn't it last week? Your dad asked you the reason you walked down the aisle with me, and you said, for the exercise. <laughs> That's funny. You're a funny guy, Charles. <laughs> Real funny guy. I'm not crying. I'm, la I'm laughing. <laughs> I'm laughing because you are about to give up on a woman that is infinitely lovable. Infinitely. For instance, Paul Sure, he was a little creepy, but he has loved me since the eighth grade. He has made 126 passes at me, proposed 47 times, and has sent me over 200 handwritten sonnets. I mean, he sees something in me, Charles, and he writes it down in metered verse. And that's not something you find every day. Someone who really loves everything about who you are as a person. Paul may be insane, but I value his feelings for me. I would never ask him to sign a piece of paper saying that he would turn off his feelings for me forever. <laughs> That's what you're asking of me. Yeah. <sighs> to sign away my right to your sweet voice, your beautiful baby blue eyes, and the way your hands fill in my hair at night just before bed. Those aren't things that I want to give up on. I won't give up, in fact. I won't lose them. And I won't, I won't lose you. I could woo you. Here, I've written you a sonnet. <laughs> Shall I compare thee to a summer's day? Thou art more lovely and more temperate. Rough winds do shake the darling buds of May. <laughs> you know, it's I'm laughing. I'm, I'm not crying because it's all a big joke. Like, it's very, very funny, Charles. I keep waiting for you to come running in and say, April Fools! And then I'll rush into your arms and... 
but you won't because it's not a joke. It's not April. I, I didn't really write that sonnet, Charles. Paul did. But I think it's great. You see, the truth is, Charles, I ate the divorce papers. I ate them with ketchup because I couldn't stomach the thought of losing you.